Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome to A-Train Gaming. Today's video, I'm going to be talking about a couple things. First off, my new upload schedule and what my plans are going to be for basically through Black Ops 3, I expect, and hopefully continuing. And then the next thing I'm going to be talking about is how humans change as age goes on and how time goes on and how drastically we change. So I'll get right into it. So first off, after a little bit of inconsistent upload for the last couple days, I finally have my computer. I had a good reason as to why I wasn't uploading, and I'm really excited that I finally have my computer. My plan is to be uploading every single day, and I think that's manageable. I wasn't doing that at first because I didn't know if I could do it with classes, but I think it's going to be a manageable thing to do. It's just some days are going to be earlier than others, some days are going to be later. So, I'll kind of, kind of, if you follow me on Twitter, it's easy to figure out when I'm going to be posting videos. So, if, I'll always link that in the description below if you want to follow me. So, my plan now that I have my new computer all set up and everything's ready to go, my plan is going to be uploading every single day, and I think that's manageable. It's just going to have to be, certain times are going to be different than others to work around my classes, but I'm going to be uploading during any time between either noon or like 6, so it's going to be random upload time, so I hopefully that doesn't matter to you guys. But yeah, uploads every single day. Uh, I'm going to be editing at night, new computer's all set up, ready to go. So, now to the other part of my video. So I'm a pretty heavy thinker at night time. Uh, I lay in bed, usually watching Netflix or listening to music for a couple of hours, and some thoughts always come into my head. And the thought that came into my head last night was actually how much humans change with age. If you don't know what I mean by that, is as we grow older, we kind of look back at our past selves and have those moments like that we cringe thinking about us, or what were we thinking, or what, we, what were we doing, like why did we think that way? And I have a lot of those moments that I'm going to talk about. If you have any of those moments, leave that in the comments below. I'd love to hear your experience with this. It always surprises me how drastically we change, too. Like, for example, I used to love to wear gym shorts and sweatpants to school. I know a lot of people do that, and I totally get why it's the most comfortable outfit for everyone. But it's just, to me, I just don't like the way it looks. I feel like I'm trying to be, like, lazy or a bum. And I am lazy, kind of, but I just don't like that look. I by no means like dressing up, going like formal, like some kids wear like suits to school or like polos. No, I, but I just can't do the gym shorts and uh, the uh, dry fit shirts look anymore. And it, which is really weird to me, because in 8th grade, that's all I wanted to do. My closet was only gym shorts and sweatpants, and I never wore anything else. Like, that was it. That was all my kid mind wanted to wear. And now I prefer like like some black de uh, denim jeans, which I, I never wore in the past. I prefer like, t-shirts with thermal long sleeve shirts under them. And for shoes, I used to wear like all the running Nike shoes or like the try to get some like LeBron shoes or something like that. Like a typical jock look. And now what I like to wear is like black Chuck Taylor Converse shoes. And it's really weird to me like how differently I thought in just a matter of like a couple years ago. I WANT THE MP40! So since I have my new computer all set up, I had some stuff I had to download. One of the things was iTunes. I know I'm one of the only kids who actually uses iTunes for music now, but all the music I've ever bought is on that site. So I was going back and looking through some music and what I was trying to make a playlist for when I play video games. And some of the music I used to listen to is just so cringeworthy. It's bad. I mean, I found at least... 10 to 12 songs of Soldier Boy. Soldier Boy! I don't remember listening to that! Wow, it's a great spawn. Oh, oh yeah, I don't suck. Me having Soldier Boy is crazy. For those of you who don't know, I don't even like rap, okay? It's very hard for me to like any type of rap. Soldier Boy? I, I was like, okay, I really don't remember most of these songs. Maybe I'm not as stupid as I thought. No, there's a song called Turn My Swag On or something like that, and I don't even remember listening to that song. I think I also found, like, a couple of 50 Cent songs, some, like, Jay-Z songs. And 50 Cent, I, I can't stand listening to. No offense to any of you like 50 Cent or anything, I, I don't have anything against him. It just, I'm not a huge fan of rap, and I don't like, like, the low, slow rappers. Like, if you like it, that's totally fine, it's just not my thing. But it's so weird to me that now I listen to more of, like, a, a pop-punk-based, like, bands, or, like, I've even started listening to, like, some EDM, and I don't like EDM at all, but... 
I didn't like EDM like two weeks ago, but then I heard a couple of songs and I'm starting to get into it. And it's just, it's so weird how quickly our mind changes and how quickly we overlook things and sort of look down upon them just because we haven't listened. Another change that happened to me, it's not so recent, is uh, I used to be a big jock. Big jock all the way through high school. And I would say until maybe 8th grade, or no, all the way through 8th grade, maybe like halfway through freshman year, my favorite thing to do in the free time was go to practice or have a game and I love I loved sports and I, I was always the first in the gym last to leave I always wanted to spend all my time in the gym once high school hit that wasn't really the case uh, it felt like in high school sports the thing that was most important was to win and to compete and it just lost its fun aspect to me I still had some fun moments but high school sports isn't something I really enjoyed even though I was pretty good at them it's not something I would particularly want to do again and I always enjoyed video games very much, but that was never my favorite thing to do. It was always one of my favorite things to do, but it was always sports. And that was just five or six years ago where I thought like that. And it's just weird how quickly your mind can change. That's going to do it for the video today, guys. Uh, let me know if you like this new kind of editing I'm doing where I kind of cut and choose. It gives me a chance, and it makes it much easier for me to edit and for me to think about what I'm talking about. I'll get better in the future. I still have to get better with doing a live comm and playing at the same time I struggle with like talking and managing to do good at the same time but leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed comment below if there's anything you want me to talk about in a future video and I will talk to you all later